Hi guys, welcome back. So today we'll be taking a look at some of the Chinese stocks listed both in Hong Kong as well as in US. So without further ado, let's first start off with uh, 9988. So you can see that uh, the week uh, Alibaba actually dropped. In fact, uh, across all the Chinese stocks, we fell quite a bit. So looking at the Alibaba charts on 998, you can see that uh, the past three days, there was a rejection of this blue conversion line. Even though we tried to go up above this uh, blue conversion line, we only finished lower. So that was a key sign of rejection. So the resistance to watch will be currently at $86. And the second resistance will be around $94, $95. So looking at the Fibonacci support on the way down from a low of around $60 to a high of uh, $118. We are at the 38.2%, which is also essentially the last support. Once we break down this uh, critical support uh, next week, then it's likely for us to fall further, likely to hit uh, 74 and potentially retest back uh, $60 for 9988. So let's take a look at uh, BABA. So for BABA, similar situation, the low of $58 to a high of one to one we can see that we are at 38.2%. It's also the last support at $82. Once we break down this support, the next one we're looking at is 73 and a potentially we test back uh, for a double bottom at $58. So looking at the resistance, the first one will be around $87, $88. Second one will be $97 at this rate baseline and also this cloud resistance. So let's take a look at Tencent. So for 0700, uh, it's slightly stronger from a low of 198 to a high of 415. We are at the, actually at this, still at this uh, 61.8% at 332.5. So if we can hold this uh, support, that would be good. If not, it's likely for us to break down further, 307 and potentially uh, 281 for uh, 0700. So as you can see, the cloud did act as the first support here. But after that, we came down after uh, rejection of this red baseline. And the blue conversion line also started to break down. So this cloud support, we have to actually climb back up next week. If not, potentially, we may see more selling pressure ahead. So for the resistance to watch, we'll be looking at 350 and around 362. So for Tencent, a similar situation. You can see that we are currently barely holding this 61.8% uh, at $42. So the next support is obviously the $40 psychological support and thereafter will be $38 and $35.50. So looking at the resistance, we're looking at $44 and $46. Uh, dollars. So next up, we have uh, Meituan. So for Meituan, it's uh, the most uh, bearish among all the Chinese uh, stocks. And as you can see, it really broke down uh, all the critical Fibonacci supports at around uh, from a low of 112.8 to high of 195. We already broke down this uh, 132.3, which is also the last support here. So it's likely for us to actually come back lower to retest back this uh, 112.8. So the two resistance to watch, first one will be this blue conversion line at 134. And second one will be around 148 at this red baseline here. So overall, you can see that the Chinese stocks appears to be uh, pretty bearish and we are currently at the very critical Fibonacci supports for the respective uh, stocks. So if we do not see buyers stepping back in next week, it's likely for us to uh, break down further for uh, all Chinese uh, constituents. So hopefully we see buyers stepping back in next week and if there's any changes, I'll give you guys an update. Thanks for stopping by. Till we meet again, appreciate the manipulation.